You know, what do you mean they're hunting down Mr. Link? Uh, there's a huge misunderstanding from what I understand. But, uh... So basically, CG thinks that Marty stole their dongles. Um, why would they assume that? I don't know, but even if they did, why aren't they going after Marty? So they're going after they're going after Buddha because they think Marty stole CG's dongles. That's what I'm saying, and it makes no sense. They should just say, "Hey, Marty, where's my dongles at?" Right? I mean, that would make sense to me. I mean, I do understand that that Marty works with you guys, but that's maybe CG is under the same impression. And usually, how it works I is like gang telling them that. Well, Marty's got his own operation. I don't have. He's got his own house. Everything, right? Oh, I was not aware. Well, I mean, I know he has his own house, but I thought I was under the impression yeah. he's working directly with you guys. I mean, he works with us, yeah, but like, I don't have keys to his place. He's running his own thing, so. Huh. Well, I guess. I mean, like, if they if he stole his stuff, I don't have access to it anyway. So, like, what could I do? I I get your perspective, but I suppose, from a gang's perspective, like CG, they like to go after the people that are closest to the people, to hurt them so that they get the stuff back. I mean, I couldn't even get them the stuff back, assuming it's even there. Yeah, I don't. So it's not uh, like, it, it doesn't make sense, right? It, it's neither could neither could Mister. Like, no, Marty's got his own keys to his own house. He's the only one with it, so it's just kind of. I mean. Yeah, I have no idea. Anyway, did, did, uh, I'm sure we could talk about that later. But yeah, let's get back to the. That's 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 a weird situation. Hopefully, Boo is alright. Uh, anyway, like I was saying. I think it's mutually beneficial that we... I mean, at a certain point, brother, there's like certain things that doesn't matter if we, we, we are honest about because it helps both groups out and these are such early heists that... I mean, it really doesn't change anything. You know, I, I'm surprised there's been actually so much betrayal and so much shit already from groups like this early on. Like, what JP did it so early, you know? But uh, Yeah, me too. I feel like people are fighting over robbing a laundromat, but... Agreed! A laundromat blows me away, but nonetheless, um, no, I thought about it a little bit. What I what I did yesterday was like a like a half truth, half lie. But I mean, I thought about it a lot, and I, I was very con very conscious about the fact that I that I that I did that, and I want to I want to say I, I don't want to do that going forward. I mean, I, thanks, appreciate that, Raymond. Of course, you know, because I I mean, at the end of the day, I think we've you've helped me a lot. You've given me like a lot of information. I did the same back with you, and I. Like, why would we stop that just because uh, my my group was so close to the end goal, you know? I mean, it doesn't really change anything. So, I don't think anyone's close to the end goal right now. Oh, no one is. I mean, we already, uh, uh, I mean, at the end of the day, we already, uh, I got the purple dongle I needed, you know? Mm hmm. That's good. So you guys are all caught up then. Yeah, I'm assuming you guys got the green that you were looking for. Oh, well, we were technically supposed to be looking for a red, but... Were you guys actually in need yeah. of a red? Yeah. I actually had extra reds. Well, that would have been good to know. That's what I was trying to ask you the other day. No, no, I, I was I was honest about that. I said that we had extra reds. But I think we had, like... If I remember correctly, we had two or three reds. Two or three reds? Jesus. Yeah. I might be wrong, though, but I'm pretty sure we had two or three. Wow. What are you going to do with the extras? I don't know yet. I, I think that I think uh, we have we have like less extras now, of course, but uh, maybe trade them for butt coin. Mm -hmm. Well, I wouldn't trade them quite yet. Why is that? I mean, what happened the first time you traded them in? What happened the first time? Uh, I think we have uh, a new heist or some shit like that, right? They uh, they upgraded you, right? Yeah. So what if you trade him in again? Wait, you think that it's well, still worth doing the laundromat? I mean, we don't know for sure, but... I mean, oh. just a thought. Just a thought. Oh, shit. Why well, even think about that? I mean, could be wrong, but it's just a thought. I mean, I think that the smart thing to do probably is to see what's next first, you know, try it out. I mean, I'm assuming you guys have, you guys 
have it now, right? So you mentioned the 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 unicorn though which is so funny because i had those uh, <laughs> we bought those a few months back too as a little joke yeah They're pretty cool but hey i appreciate you telling me all this raymond i've got a whole nother headache to deal with i guess i'm, I'm not sure so what's happening with this stuff sorry you guys have to deal with that i know that uh, cg has a lot of guns and stuff like that i'm sure you guys have guns too but yeah but, i mean well i'm not looking to fight i think it's a misunderstanding it's gotta be so Marty, Marty took dongles from CG. I heard that. I what I heard is that JP and Marty were having an argument earlier. And I then, guess so, yeah. And then what? Marty took the dongles from CG. What? And then gave them to to JP, and there was an argument about it. I'm not a hundred percent sure. I mean, I feel like Marty wouldn't steal dongles, but I mean, if that's what they're saying, I would want Marty to give them back to him. I agree. I think uh, making an enemy out of, like, CG right now is probably, I don't know. I guess my interpretation on it is it seems too too early for so, so many conflicts, you know what I mean? That's what I'm saying. But the biggest thing is I don't really like stealing. If Marty stole, we should just give it back. Is what I'm thinking. The fair thing. just call him. What, what is JP's opinion about all this? I don't know, but my guess is he's probably super upset. Want to know something funny? Yeah. He called the company today and was asking oh. to work with us again. What? He came and, uh, crawling back to ODT and asked him to work with us again. Jesus. And said that and, he was uh, literally willing to give everything back. Just to work with this again. And that went... Why? why? Well, I don't... I don't. <laughs> imagine, you know. Imagine when I heard that. I. <laughs> did you take a... Oh, I'm assuming you didn't. He said he was going to give us seven racks of 660s back and a purple Jesus. dongle in good faith just to work with us again. And he would give the purple dongle first before any of that. Wow. Why didn't you take the deal? Um, I don't remember. I don't know if I was told the reason why the deal didn't happen. But I, I'm, I'm assuming it's because why the hell would I ever work with that guy again? Yeah, I mean, if he robbed you once, now you've got even more to lose. Yeah, way more to lose. Like, if he gave us the stuff back, we have, like, more than... Uh, way more than that. Like, double that? So, like, you got to think about the fact, like... I, me, me personally, you know... I only really give people like one or two chances. I will never work with John Paul again on a personal level like that. You know, like house keys, shit like that. Ever. Mm -hmm. Ever again. I will never trust that person, that, that man again because there's only so much you can do to a group right now. And taking all of yeah. their racks and, and all their possessions and their bench and just pawning it off is insane to me. Probably the worst thing you could do. I mean... Yeah, imagine if you were to go to 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 boot in them and take all of their shit, and then start like selling their fucking shit on on Twitter or like, uh, it's insane to me. It would be pretty bad, but I wouldn't do that. You wouldn't do that to anybody. I mean, you know me. I don't like stealing from people. Yeah. I robbed the guy of his Grimes boxes a few weeks ago, and that just felt terrible. I only steal from locals, if you know what I mean. Yeah, of course. I mean, I know you wouldn't. I mean, you got so much shit from the man because you took he, you took one computer desk that you paid me personally for that I put towards the, the, yeah. the company fund. I told him that, and he just kept ignoring the fact that I told him that. And then he yeah, went it's crazy that he was upset about the one computer, and then he stole, like, that times, like, a thousand. And then he asks us to come back? He's just yeah insane to me. He's a little crazy, but he is makes crazy. Him good at figuring stuff out sometimes. Yeah, but you know, I would rather be a little bit slower on the uptake and be with people that I trust and actually are working towards a common goal than than, than whatever the hell that is. Making enemies yeah. of everyone, robbing everyone, like being an antag an antagonistic figure to, to literally just about everyone we saw, and then betraying the the, the very people that cared about him. For a little bit more pro personal progress was insane to me. Mm -hmm. I mean, sounds like it backfired this time, right? 
Yeah. You know what the reason he he, he told OGT he did it? Mm -hmm. He said because he didn't like me and Mickey. But if I remember correctly, every day I woke up, the first person who called me was him. When he needed help, he'd call me. When he needed like uh, help searching for shit, information, anything like that, he he would have me there with them, uh, like a like a duo. And then he and he says to him, and says to ODT, the reason he left the company was because of me. Did he say specifically why? I mean, he, he said just he didn't like you. He said he didn't like me. But it's insane well, to me. Interesting. I, I mean, I know. I mean, I told uh, when I when I heard this, the information I said is like, that's a lie. I mean, he told OTT that he didn't like us because he wanted a reason. He wanted to, to gaslight us and to think there was a reason for it. But all he really cares about, you know, is his own personal progress. And he doesn't care about putting other people down around him to, to, to achieve his goals. You know what I mean? That does sound like the JP we know. That's exactly the man. I guarantee you he did care about us. But he, his care for us was less than his care for, uh, for advancing. And that's why he's going crazy right now, because he wasn't the first one to do it. Yeah, he wasn't. Wait, so does that mean you... Did you guys do it before us? You guys did it before us. <laughs> Who cares, right? Who cares? That's what I'm trying to say. Yeah, well, except for JP, who is currently trying to start some crazy war that doesn't need to happen. But, uh... I guess we'll see how that goes. Yeah, that should be well, interesting. Hey, I'm glad you didn't take him back. No, never. Genuinely, never. I will never work with someone that steals from me, especially when I'm asleep. Like, the, at least face me face to face and tell me that he, he didn't like us working with us or anything like that. Yeah. That he didn't. He, he literally said in the note he changed his phone number. Uh, he didn't. But he said he changed his phone did. number not to yeah, con not to contact his number. I never even talked to him since. Yeah. Well, honestly, it sounds like you're doing better now than ever, right? Oh, we're doing fantastic. And I'm happy. And that's why I brought you here today, because I want to talk to you about the fact that, like, I want to help, you know, the people I care about grow. And I know, obviously, you're a smart man, and you can help me grow. I mean, we're both very, I mean, we, I mean, listen, we're both very capable people. Not very many people were in the clean boys, you know, not very many people advanced like we did. Yeah, it's pretty true. So is there any questions you guys need, you just ask me, all right? And I'll, you know, of course, I'll do the same. Yeah, of course. Thanks, Raymond. Appreciate it. Yeah, let me let me drive you to where I need to be. Here's your hug, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> you remember that meme? You yeah, the do? meme. Where's my hug? Yeah. Well, I got to figure out all oh, this whole mess with Mr. K and Rami. All right. Well, yeah, let me give you a ride to your house or whatever. I hope, uh, hope you guys take care of that because... Uh, I don't, I don't think they're probably joking about that. I don't think so either, but we think... genuinely don't have their stuff. I mean, when did that security? If they think card? Marty took it, then I feel like Marty would be the guy to ask. Is Marty not awake right now? I don't know. Let me, let me call him now. Maybe he's awake. <laughs> but without him, we can't really figure out what this thing is. I think they're just getting worked up because they want to, you know, turn in the dongles. And, if Marty's not awake, he can't really answer all these questions. Yeah, I mean, I, I kind of agree with you. I feel like Marty's very uh, important to that whole discussion. I mean, they're saying he's the guy who stole it, so... Why would Marty have access to CG's dongles in the first place? That's what I'm saying, like... That doesn't make any sense to me. They what? just hand it to him? Did he help hold him up? Like, or? I, I know Mr. K is pretty, uh, pretty cautious yeah, with his, his stuff. Yeah, he's smart. Yeah, I don't see how... I don't think he would allow Marty to have access to uh, their stash of, of stuff at CG House. Unless Marty's working with you guys and with CG, which I don't think so. Yeah, that would be crazy. But even if he was, wouldn't that just be more reason to go for him and not randomly go for... Like, you For know? you guys? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I mean, maybe CG, if they are working with Marty, and Marty's working with them, is aware that his relationship with you guys is very close, and then he would assume if he was to steal stuff, he would go immediately to you guys. That's just an interpretation that I would, you know, I mean, obviously I don't know. Oh, wait. Did you take me to Senior Buns, actually? I'm about to pass out. Sure. <laughs> I got you. Do you need water or food? Uh, both. 
Yeah, here's some water in the cold box. I don't have food. Oh, thanks. 